like this color right here without the light. talk about uh, why people think I look like Play with Cardi or anime, anime. So I'm gonna tell y'all a little bit about myself, okay? I've been doing a lot of, of course, dread videos and stuff like that, but today is gonna be very different because I'm gonna talk about myself, okay? Get to know me, get to know me one-on-one. -on -one. I was raised in uh, Ethiopia. Adis Ababa is where I'm raised. A lot of people actually uh, kind of hit me up on like IGs and stuff like that. They be like, why are you trying to act like you're from out here or something? I'm like, I don't try to act like I'm, I'm playing or whatever. Well, where I'm from, and I represent it 100%. I'm, I'm, I'm Ethiopian. I represent more, more so. I represent the kingdom of God. On social, Hallelujah. On social, on social medias or anything like that, because you know, saying the Bible says, though we are of this world. No, though we, though, <laughs> it says, though, <laughs> though we are in this world, we're not of this yeah, world. So different thing, you know, what I'm saying like we can really talk about ethnicity. We can talk about. Uh, being black or being Asian or being Mexican or being white, but at the end of the day, if that's, that that doesn't really give us our identity in the life to come. So yeah, that's that will blow your mind actually when you understand that. This we just here for a short period of time, man. Eh? So okay, yeah. People think I look like Playboy Cardi. <laughs> just because you know, I say I could rap like him. I'm like this color right here without the light. And so, yeah, I look like Eminem because Eminem is from Ethiopia. He used to be my neighbor, actually. I'm just kidding. Basically, what you learned today is that I am Ethiopian, okay? So don't be coming at me like that. You feel me? Know where I'm from. And like it or not, hate on, hate, hate on it or not, I do not care, man. And a lot of people think, oh, he look at him trying to act like he American. Uh, whatever, bro. I've been here for like eight years now. I don't speak with an accent. Well, I, I don't think I got an accent. A lot of people think they don't got an accent, but they do got an accent. But I'm, I'm one of those people that, that don't got an accent at all. We're going to look at Ethiopia and what Ethiopia look like, okay, guys? We're going to look at Ethiopia and what Ethiopia look like. So, I'm going to look Ethiopia and show you guys where Ethiopia is at. So, Ethiopia is located in East Africa, and around it is like Sudan, Somali, Kenya, Uganda, and Eritrea. And if, as you go up, you see Egypt. So, a lot of people know Egypt because of the pyramid, right? But they don't know about Ethiopia because Ethiopia is known for being the poorest country in the world, which is a lie. That's a lie. That's, a, that's some stuff they had to tell y'all when y'all didn't eat food. Oh, there's people starving in Ethiopia. Yeah, there's people starving right, right around your corner, boy. The homeless people you, you have right down the street in LA. And so, and so, uh, yeah, Ethiopia, actually, that's where uh, the coffee that you guys drink from Starbucks, that's where it comes from. Coffee, literally, I believe, literally originated from Ethiopia. And go look it up for yourself if you don't really believe me. Um, but uh, Ethiopia is surrounded with uh, like countries that are really known. But I talk to a lot of people and they kind of don't know where Ethiopia is at. They know Ethiopia is in Africa, but they don't know exactly where it's at. So East Africa is where it's at. And Ethiopia is like one of the ancient countries and ancient people, uh, all the people together right around our area, not just Ethiopia, but the people around it are like one of the ancient people known in history. and. Uh, a lot of people believe that that's where Christianity actually formed. Well, not not the fact that somebody made it up there, but the the name of it and the following of it grew a lot much in Ethiopia and around that area. If you guys search up like the ancient like kings and queens, one of the kings and queens that were in Ethiopia, uh, like very big and very uh, known for it is uh, for what she did was like I think Queen uh, Queen Sheba. A lot of people know her uh, by her. Uh, amount of like the amount of wealth that she had and, and the kingdom that she had and where her husband I do not know the name of it. I didn't like history. I can tell. I don't like history at all. History was the worst class I ever I ever was in my life. But I started to like it as 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 I moved on in life and I moved out here to uh, to USA. I actually started liking my history because I started being mature and you know what I'm saying? Kinda like learn about it when people ask me and stuff like that. But yeah man. That's where I'm from, and dreads originated from Ethiopia also, just because people that down there had a very, like, 
hair is like mine. So there's like different type of hairs and textures. And based on your texture, like there's some countries in East or West Africa that can really grow their hair because their hair don't grow. Like literally, it stops or it grows very slow. I wouldn't say it doesn't grow, but it grows very slow and it's very like coily. And so they can't really do dreads. But like around the area that I'm from, people have the my type of hair. So whenever you grow out your hair, it just automatically free forms. Just like the weekend, the weekend is Ethiopian. And you saw you guys free form, I'll put it right here. And uh, yeah, and I feel like, I don't know what, Playboy Cardi has like a tree on him, in him or something, so Molly. But I think that's why they look like me. That's why Aminade look like me. A lot of people think I'm like, Aminade, little brother or older brother, that big brother. But really not, I'm not his brother, but yeah, that's where Ethiopia is at and that's where America is at. You know what I'm saying? And that's where I'm at. You know what I'm saying? I can show you my address right now. I don't want to come down. Oh, I'm just cap. Uh, yeah, man. I've been here for eight years and thank you for tuning to this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and you guys some had some laugh and learned about Ethiopia and where I'm from. Because I, I feel like, I feel like sometimes when I talk, the way I talk or the, the, the way I do things is very different because because of those reasons. So I'm letting you guys know, uh, you know what I'm saying, and get this hair retwisted like you guys always say. But till next time, we out. Boom.